Hi everyone, Natasha here and around my home today. Welcome to the floor of our living room or uh, parlor. This is the more formal um, front room, entertaining room of the house, but we are here for some cleanup. So today is Monday, December 6th, and we are on to our cleanup missions from the fly lady. Fly lady. So these are your holiday cleanup missions, and this is to get our Christmas stuff put away and cleaned up for the new year. So I had hoped to start on some of this earlier than now, but here we are. My daughter's back in school, so today I'm starting on it. And I only have about five minutes, so I'm going to have to keep an eye on the time because it's time to go pick her up in just a few minutes. So what I'm working on, I will show you in just a second. Let me turn the camera around and I'll be right back. So here is our beautiful Christmas tree. So lovely. And then we get down to <laughs> the rest of Christmas, which is still sitting out and still needing to be put away. Um, it keeps going, don't worry. <laughs> I guess on the on the upside, I've been working on just bringing everything in here so that we can collect it all, put it away. I'm, this is what I'm going to work on today and hopefully get all this cleaned up this week. Okay, so what I have besides my notes from the fly lady on what we're cleaning up, um, she says just to take 15 minutes to go through, um, put away the wrapping paper, the bags, the bows, the tags, the tape, and I love how she says this, don't just stuff them somewhere. <laughs> if they don't have a home, then make a home for them, throw away the scraps, that you stuffed into a box and shoved into the closet right before the holiday. And she says, don't ask me how I know that. Trust me that I know. I don't think I have anything shoved in a closet, but I've got a nice pile here. So what I'm gonna do is work on uh, just breaking down these boxes and taking everything down for recycling. So that's gonna be my little project for the next five minutes. So hopefully you are joining along and maybe it's just gathering things up for you. Um, for right now, I think we're good as far as like tape and scissors, all those things kind of have a home and they just stay in that home. Even when we're wrapping gifts, they just go right back. So that is good. We have a pretty good system for that. Granted, I could probably go through and just declutter some things that we're not using anymore or like the little scraps, but for, for today, <laughs> my focus is just to make some kind of progress in here so I feel like I've at least started uh, who knows when my daughter gets home in a little bit I might have her help me and we'll finish up a few other things but for the most part I think if I can just break down these boxes that'll be a really good place to start so I love that the fly lady system um, is really all about breaking things into baby steps and not getting overwhelmed because that's something I can definitely uh, easily do is take a small project and in my mind create some big masterful project out of it, but then I never complete it. So um, it's just good to have, have some of those things uh, in mind when I'm either planning or just, you know, working on things. So I'm going to put this stuff in here. Hashtag. And already I can see more floor in here, which is helping. So I've got trash there. Those are actually some gifts that need to be put away. We ended up having to get a new Blu-ray player because ours has been on the fritz for quite some time. I don't think we need that, so I think that can be recycled as well. So that is nice to have because we do watch DVDs and Blu-rays from time to time. There we go. And I think I just have maybe one or two more boxes tucked away here. Let's see. This one is really just all bags. So that can go in there. I think this one, yeah, there's a couple of larger bags I had already folded up. So those will be for, um, I like to use those for trash bags or recycling bags if they're larger. And they can work for that. So those will just go in our little bag caddy thing in the pantry. And this one is broken down. How am I doing on time? Ooh, three and a half minutes. Okay. <laughs> Not so bad, see? This was this big old pile that was 
again, in my head, I thought, oh, it's just going to take a while, and I don't have time for it. Well, I'm making time, and all it's taking is five minutes. Okay, so that can go. This is all of my... Here we go. There's my cardboard to be recycled. I have paper that's already folded and ready to go down to recycling, or I don't know, I have to check. I think this foil paper may not recycle, but disposed of either way. And then I have this bag of just trash. So that's gonna go down as well. And then, like I said, this bag that's already folded, I'll put that in our bag collection caddy thingy. So, all right, so that's it. That's my five minutes. I'm at four minutes and 22 seconds on this batch of uh, filming, so I think I'll be okay. And I'm so glad I got it done. So don't put it off. Don't think it's gonna take a long time. Get your timer out and just see what you can get done or use my videos as a timer and we'll get it all cleaned up and put away and get the house back in order for the new year. So thanks for joining me. Look forward to seeing you tomorrow for another cleanup mission. And don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.